Hey, welcome back to Grand Adventure. I'm your host, Mark Guido, and a little bit earlier this winter, we asked if you folks were interested in an episode for winter camping, uh, possibly combined with skiing. And we're going to do both in this episode, so stay tuned. So we're at Jordan L State Park, which is right outside of Park City, Utah. Uh, the lake is still iced over and the campgrounds are still closed until the snow melts and they can get them ready in the spring. In the meantime, they're letting us asphalt dock here in the marina parking lot at the state park. And right there over my left shoulder, those are the slopes, the ski slopes of Deer Valley Resort. Jordan L State Park's Hailstone Campground is one of the largest and most popular in the Utah State Park system. Many partial hookup sites are available in summer, but in winter, the campground remains closed. However, park officials permit overnight parking in the partially plowed marina parking lot for $16 per night with no hookups available. Our campsite at Jordan now is also only about 15 minutes to the historic resort town of Park City's vibrant Main Street. Thank you. 
Well, I guess the weather service underestimated how cold it was going to get last night. Our site at Jordanelle is only a quick two and a half mile drive from the base of the Jordanelle gondola at Deer Valley Resort. Deer Valley Resort was founded by the late hotelier Edgar Stern, who for the first time applied the same principles of running a high-end hotel to the ski resort experience. This is one of the most plush ski resorts in the entire country, and Deer Valley folks call it the Deer Valley Difference. I'm Emily Summers, Senior Communications Manager for Deer Valley Resort. If you ask a Deer Valley employee what sets this resort apart, we're going to call it the Deer Valley Difference. The difference is in the details to us, and that could be from the food service and our famous Deer Valley Turkey Chili, to the freshly manicured slopes and the corduroy we lay down every single night, to the details, the details of unloading your car at our ski valet, helping you check into ski school, the limited lift ticket sales each day, the ski only experience. We're hoping to anticipate our guest needs before they even know what they need. And that's what we call the Deer Valley Difference. Before they were mining white gold in Park City, they were mining silver. And many relics of the town's mining past still remain, even alongside the ski slopes. Now, Emily mentioned the food service at Deer Valley Resort. 
This isn't a place to brown bag, for you won't find the usual greasy burgers and cold french fries here. And despite the quality, lunches here aren't hideously overpriced, the way that they are at many ski resorts across the U.S. So we really hope that you've enjoyed coming RVing with us and skiing with us here at Deer Valley Resort. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up down below. If you're not yet one of our grand adventurers, there's a little red subscribe button waiting for you in the bottom right corner right now. Now we'd be honored if you share Grand Adventure with your friends and family. We remain available for your comments and suggestions in the comment section down below this video. Remember, we publish a new episode each and every Wednesday. So until next week. Remember, life is nothing but a grand adventure. We'll see you soon.